Hey everybody, Jason Blaha here, just eating a little bit of ice cream. This is a uh, Choco Cone, it's 174 calories. I'm going to eat this whole box today. Let me give you guys a bicep shot. Alright, I'm going to make today's video really, really quick. Um, we hear a lot of these uh, sayings like the 80-20 rule or the 90-10 rule when it comes to bodybuilding and fitness, meaning that people seem to put 80 or 90 percent of their focus on the things that only give them 10 to 20 percent of their results. And nutrition is just like any other area there. Um, so what are the two most important factors in your body composition nutritionally? What aspects of your diet? And if you have to narrow it down, which two factors give you 90 percent of your progress in terms of changes in body composition? And those two factors are protein intake and calories. Literally, literally every other aspect of your nutrition and diet, whether it has to do with your timing, the composition of your meals, your carbs versus your fat, account for 10% or less of your results in body composition, period, flat out. So, I mean, if, if you're worrying about this stuff and, and you're not spending most of your energy worrying about your protein and caloric intake, you're just wasting your fucking time. You're wasting your time. And I would, I would actually go so far as to say that it's 99% of your results, other than if I do that, there's going to be some dumbass who, who thinks that that means that he can eat a completely unbalanced diet and either cut out all fat or all carbs, or that he can just go on a diet of pure whey protein and table sugar that's completely micronutrient void and not even take any vitamins. And so I would say it actually accounts for 99% of those two factors other than uh, I'm going to get a complete moron who's going to take it the wrong way and they're going to do something stupid. So I'm going to, I'm going to stick with 90%. And I will say that as long as you have a fairly balanced diet, um, those two factors as far as your, your, the nutritional end of your intake, not the training end or other lifestyle factors, but just the nutrition end, those two factors are going to determine 98 to 99% of your uh, direct results and changes in body composition. And that's all I have for you today, and I'll talk to you next time. And I'm going to finish this ice cream.